Hello and welcome to Alfesta. In this video, we're going to learn how to trickle charge the battery in this 2023 Julia Quadrifolio. All right, so let's talk about what trickle charging means. And what that means is that you're going to be sending a small voltage to your battery to keep it fully charged when you're not using the vehicle. And you're gonna use a device that looks something like this, okay? This is just, a, uh, this particular one is Naco Genius. Uh, there's various brands out there. I'm not sponsored, so I'm just showing you guys what I use in my case. And what this device does is that it sends a small voltage to the battery to keep it fully charged when you're not using the car. All right, in my case, I don't get to use this car as much as I'd like to. There's times when the car will just sit here for a month, a month and a half, and I'm not driving it. So this is just a, a, an extra precaution to make sure that the battery stays fully charged. This also extends the battery life of your car so that it's not you know, depleting you know, less than 50%, for example. It's always keeping the battery fully charged. Now, I will mention that there's a lot of comments, videos, and, and different posts online that saying that these cars are not reliable, that they have issues, especially with the batteries. Now, th this has not been my experience. I've owned this car for a little bit over a year now. And before I started using this system, which I just recently started using this, by the way, I never had an issue with the car not starting, okay? So I would just, it would just sit there. I was not using a battery charger or, or trickle charging the car. And I never had any problems with the car not starting at all, even though it was just sitting there for weeks. Now let's take a look at how we're going to use this system. Uh, basically it's pretty simple in the quadrifolio version of this car. Uh, you have this right here, which is your positive terminal for the battery, okay? There's a little plastic uh, flap right here that you move back and then you can uh, connect the positive lead right here and then you have here a ground post which you connect the negative lead there all right so let's go ahead and take a look at how we're going to do that so basically i'm going to take my positive here my positive lead and i'm going to go ahead and move this back and hook it up right there okay just like that once that is secured i'm going to go ahead and grab the negative lead and i'm going to connect it to this ground post right here all right, once you have that, those two things connected right there, I can go ahead and take this unit right here and plug it into an outlet, okay? And this is just gonna cycle through there for a minute and then it's gonna be ready for me to use. Right now, I can select the battery type. In my case, I have the original battery, so that's an AGM battery. If you happen to have a different uh, aftermarket battery, that you can select these uh, different modes right here, okay? So I'm just gonna leave it there as AGM and as it begins to charge you may see this light here changing different colors it will show red when it's below a certain percentage and then it'll start showing green once you start getting to the ideal um, battery charge and then it will be solid green when it's fully charged and this unit is smart enough to know when to cut power so it's not going to overcharge your battery it'll cut power uh, once the battery is fully charged and then when the battery starts discharging again, then it will go ahead and kick in automatically and begin recharging again. So when you're ready to drive the car, you can just unplug this unit from the wall, or you can go over here and first disconnect the negative, and then you disconnect the positive, all right? And then you can safely disconnect the unit from the wall. So yeah, that's how you trickle charge the battery in the Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrifoglio. If you guys have any questions, just comment below, I'll get back to you. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.